This segment of Panther Sports Talk is brought to you by Lincoln Savings Bank. At home in Iowa, at work for you. Welcome to Panther Sports Talk. We're here with Jamar Thompson, former Panther, who is the Associate Athletic Director for External Affairs. And so much happening that month of November, the overlap with the winter sports starting, the fall sports going on. And this past week, week and a half, was busy here on the UNI campus. Yeah, just a busy time for us here in the athletic department, uh, dealing with crossover season. So we have the basketball starting up uh, with wrestling in addition to the football and volleyball coming to a close. So uh, when you look at our schedule, even just this last week, having women's basketball on Sunday versus Iowa be sold out, uh, Tuesday versus uh, Loris for men's basketball, and then Wednesday for volleyball, and then you look at Thursday, Friday for high school playoffs in the Dome, and then Saturday, our last home regular season football game. So a whole bunch of events going on, taking place, our staff managing it all and doing it to a T like they always do, but uh, it's certainly a busy time of year for us right now. How special is it? I know that the relationship with the Iowa High School Boys Athletic Association is really important to keep that event here and, and to make it a special event for years to come. Yeah, just this summer, we announced an extension of our partnership to have the state high school football championship stay here in the Dome. And it's so great to see all the kids, uh, parents and grandparents come through our facility because a lot of them, it's the first time they've maybe been on campus. And so they're here inside the Dome when weather's not a factor to cheer on their teams to a, a state championship. And so every game is one team's going to be on the high of success and one's going to be on the low of, of just falling short of winning what they wanted to get. But having those people here in our facility, in our community, on our campus certainly is a big thing for us as a whole throughout the Cedar Valley. So we talked about briefly you and I hosting the Iowa Hawkeyes. Historic. You don't have historic uh, breaking records all too often, and it was, and it was quite an atmosphere as you and I women's basketball has never hosted that many people inside the McLeod Center. As you look back on it, uh, how did that event go, and, and why was it special for the athletic department? We've had a lot of planning in place since last year, since we knew we had Iowa on the schedule and knowing that they were runners up last year in the national championship game. So we knew there was a lot of excitement, so we tried to put things in place uh, to make sure that everything, everything could go off without a hitch. And so we wanted to give our chance to have that place filled with purple, as much purple as possible, right? To give our team a chance. And so there's a lot of excitement with the team uh, this year being picked first uh, preseason, but having one of the top teams, if not the top team in women's basketball come to our facility and compete uh, is special and hopefully we continue to grow on that for our women's basketball program. And the volleyball team, the in-state rival Drake, to run the table undefeated in the Missouri Valley Conference for the second straight year. Just how incredible is that what that program's done under Bobby Peterson? Bobby's success historically has just been amazing. Uh, the way she runs her team, the way the student athletes respond, the way she builds a culture to get people to really buy into what she's doing, uh, just shows. Uh, so going 18 and 0, sweeping the conference, and then going 19 match win streak, just shows the hard work and time that the team put forth. And then the winter sports, they're here. Basketball and wrestling, they're, they're off and running along with swimming. Yeah, we're excited for winter sports uh, to kick on, uh, kick up here. So uh, basketball is being home here in the next couple weeks and, uh, and wrestling being home, having the first duel here on uh, the 10th of December. Excited for that transition and get everyone up and running, our student athletes competing once again. Why are season tickets and individual tickets important for the community to come out and support all your programs here? These student athletes put so much time in into their craft to make sure that they can be the best that they can be day in and day out in the hours that people don't see. And uh, showing support and um, belief in what they're doing and being at our events and attending and cheering them on uh, only fuels their drive and gives us the best chance for success on the matter in the court. So come on out, support the Panthers. It's awesome entertainment and they do need their support as they contend for those conference titles. Back with more Inside the Dome right after this here on Panthers Sports Talk.